Real CCN Trends co present Feminism India 2023, hosted by Manipur Tourism, co powered by Aura Fine Jewelry, makeup partner Color Bar Made for Magic, and co powered by Rajni Gandha Pearls. We can't keep calm because we have a brand new Miss India. Jee haan, Feminist India 2023 ki winner hai, drum roll, Nandini Gupta from Rajasthan. The 19-year-old impressed the esteemed panel of judges with her confidence, intelligence and beauty. Aur in ke sar par hai Miss India ka taj. Delhi ki Shreya Punja aur Manipur ki Thano Jams Trela Luang were crowned as the first and second runners-up respectively. Kya te hamari winners ke thoughts about winning these prestigious crowns? Feminine Miss India World 2023, how is this? How's that Oh my god, this feeling is so surreal. I cannot actually explain it into words and I hope I do this no, proud. I mean, when my name was announced, we were holding hands and you know, everybody was tightening and then when my name was announced, I mean, I'm Miss India, Rajasthan, I was like, wow, the crown is really mine now. And I'll be the reigning queen, <laughs> if you say so. And I think that the peak was so surreal, like I said. I'm so out of words. Thank you for the love and thank you for the support. Congratulations. Oh my God. Feminine Miss India, 2023 first runners up. I'm going to repeat that. Uh, congratulations. Tell me, has the feeling settled in? No, what are you, what not, are you? not yet. Not yet. Still going in. Lots of overflowing emotions at the moment. But. Uh, I think I'm going to take another couple of hours to actually catch up with the moment. But uh, yes, thank you so much India. I've been getting so much love from all of you ever since the pageant started. And uh, Manipur, you were amazing. Like I've said a thousand times before. And yes, looking forward. What a night this has been. Congratulations. Femina Miss India 2023 second runner-up. You made it! How are you feeling? I'm feeling... I don't know, it feels like a dream. <laughs> but surely it feels awesome. And I am... All the emotions are really coming true. Really excited to, you know, look forward to what is stored in front of me. You got the loudest cheer from Manipur. They are so proud of you. So I should say thank you to all the people of Manipur. Thank you so much, Honorable Chief Minister of Manipur, Sri N. Birin Singh, is khas mauke pe maujudte. Also present were Ananya Pandey, Bhumi Pednekar and Karthik Aryan. Bollywood star Karthik Aryan performed at the pageant and interacted with his fans. Can we tell you about a Miss India experience and you got such fab response? It was an amazing experience and uh, uh, my first time when I was watching Miss India, uh, so I'm, I'm just... Uh, I mean, I don't know. It was an experience which I can't. I can't say anything. It was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. In fact, it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. Because in Manipur, the crowd is a lot of fun. Yes. It's a lot of fun. Yes. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. The show is over for one hour, but at that time, the energy was the next level. Neha Dhupia, former Femina Miss India and a member of the jury this year, also shared her thoughts on the pageant's evolution and her thoughts on Manipur as this year's location. You know, I have to ask this question in true honesty. This actually takes me back to the time when um, I became Miss India in 2002. And that was one of the last moments that I saw that the contest actually moved out of Mumbai and we were in Hyderabad. It's so great to see that a contest that's that's so, uh, you know, um, it's, it's called Miss India because it's nationwide. It stands for, for everything that the country stands for. And a part of the country that's, you know, where the beauty is spoken about, everybody knows about Manipur. But, uh, you know, the opportunity that we've got today as a beauty pageant, the opportunity that we've got today to visit a state like this, and the way they welcomed us with open arms, it's really surreal. And I can't wait to go inside and see an auditorium full of people who are just going to be cheering for the fact that we're all here together tonight and yes the best one to take the crown home the grand finale of Feminist India 2023 will be telecast on Sunday April 14th at 10am on Colors
Congratulations to the winners and we hope ki aap desh ka aur apne state ka naam roshan kare. Get a chance to feature on Zoom TV. Ho ja Zoomify.